uh, in kind of introduction. <laughs> so actually, uh, on the editorial board, uh, we have two editor in chief. So I, I'm one of uh, editor in chief. <laughs> so. Uh, Okay, good. <laughs> so I'd like to tell you today uh, what is what the journal of the Mathematical Society of Japan is like and uh, where the journal is heading for. So let me first uh, summarize the overview of our journal. So our journal was founded in 1984 and is published quarterly by the Mathematical Society of Japan. So uh, most Japanese mathematicians believe uh, our journal is the best of all mathematical journals published in Japan. The journal covers a wide range of peer mathematics. So we accept uh, some applied mathematics Papers, but uh, uh, even uh, how to say? So we accept uh, papers, including the proof. So it's important. The electronic access to the articles is offered through uh, Project Euclid and JSTage. <laughs> Project Euclid uh, covers. Uh, late volumes, though uh, JSTage uh, covers all the volumes. The free access to back issues uh, is provided uh, three years after publication. So uh, these <laughs> line graphs uh, shows uh, the number of Submit to papers and uh, the number of GF3 papers. So uh, this, these purple lines uh, denote the total number of submitters. And uh, the uh, red lines and yellow lines denote uh, the numbers of uh, papers uh, submitted inside Japan uh, and from, submitted from overseas. So the big jump from yes. The yes. Uh, this <laughs> yes. So th this year, uh, in 2009, we started uh, the electronic uh, submission system. But uh, the, our electronic submission system is uh, nothing but to submit papers by email. It doesn't mean uh, the electronic editorial system. We have not yet uh, uh, employed that system. So uh, anyway, uh, at this time, uh, the number of submitted papers drastically increased. So, uh, yes, this is uh, uh, the number of uh, uh, submit papers from abroad. So, actually, uh, the papers uh, from abroad uh, increased in number. <coughs> now, uh, the rate of acceptance is uh, about one fourth. So uh, this bar graph shows the same figures in a different way uh, from uh, the last slide. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so th uh, this 
pie graph uh, shows uh, this pie graph classifies the submission area. So before uh, the electronic submission system started, uh, the number of uh, the rate of papers submitted inside Japan is uh, about 60 percent. On the other hand, uh, the percentage of uh, papers from Asia and the Middle East and China and India uh, is only uh, 14, 14 percent before uh, the electronic submission system started. But uh, after the electronic submission system started, uh, the percentage of submitted papers inside Japan is about 40 percent, 40 percent now. On the other hand, uh, the percentage of papers from Asia and the Middle East, China, uh, and India is uh, about uh, more than a quarter, one fourth. Oops. So uh, this is uh, Thomson Reuters impact factors. So I, to tell the truth, uh, I don't like, uh, the <laughs> I do not really like this impact factor, but uh, many people are, are interested in. So fortunately, our journal uh, seems to have an upward tendency in impact factor. So uh, probably one of the reasons uh, for this upward tendency is uh, the increasing number of uh, submitted papers from abroad, probably. So uh, this bar graph show the, the circulation numbers uh, of printed versions. Unfortunately, a printed version is uh, getting uh, less and less important nowadays. So, yes, uh, <laughs> maybe uh, the number of uh, the circulation in inside Japan uh, is stable. On the other hand, uh, the circulation abroad uh, is gradually decreasing. But I, we want to keep the circulation of printed version. So uh, let me mention our ongoing project. So th this is co quite similar to the last talk. <laughs> so first, uh, now inviting associate editors from abroad. So now we are trying to invite three foreign mathematicians in the field of uh, algebra, geometry, and analysis to edit our board. The second project is archiving old volumes. This is also important. Now we are trying to provide free access to articles in old volumes through JSTage. JSTage is supported by uh, JSPS. Oh, JSC, sorry, sorry, yes. It's, it, it's a slightly different organization. Yes, JST, yes, JSTage is supported by, yes. JST, right. So, finally, uh, I'd like to uh, tell you the problems now we are facing. 
So it is all, these are also quite similar to <laughs> Korean, the journal book of KMS. <laughs> so how to, the biggest problem is how to in, uh, increase uh, the circulation abroad. So uh, we want, uh, especially uh, we pay attention to East Asian countries, for example, China, Korea, Taiwan, and India, as well as North America and Europe. <laughs> because uh, uh, these three countries, including Korea, uh, the mathematical level is drastically going up. So we'd like to invite you to submit your papers to our journal. The second problem is uh, how to raise the status of JMSJ, especially abroad, overseas. So it's, it's a quite difficult. And on the other hand, we would like, we would rather keep uh, the review process uh, fair and reliable to everyone than shorten the turnaround round of uh, the review. So we would like to keep uh, the time of the review process. The third problem is uh, how to make the financial foundation of JMSJ more stable. So up to, until this year, uh, JSPS has supported uh, our journal. But uh, uh, the grant system is <coughs> changing now. So we cannot expect uh, from next year on uh, JSPS uh, will uh, give the same support. So uh, promotion and marketing are more important right now. Okay, thank, thank you for your attention.